realize what the hell. In today's video, we are Damn. back with another loyalty test. We will be seeing if Rome's girlfriend will cheat on him for a chance to be famous. However, the events in this video led up to me being in the hospital, but I'll get more into that later in this test. Well, a guy named Rome contacted me in today's video oh, to put his girlfriend get... to the loyalty test because he feels like she will stop at nothing to become famous. And he believes that she is just one major chance away from maybe walking away from him. So with all the emails that I get on a daily basis, this one literally just went over my head. We actually ended up meeting through an old decoy in one of my videos named Don. So when I met Rome, he explained to me that he's been dating this girl for the past five years. And throughout the five year relationship, she's been chasing this dream of becoming famous. In the 10 years that she has been trying to make a name for herself, Rome has watched her gradually lose herself in the pursuit of this dream. Explain to me, why do you feel like your girlfriend's cheating on I mean, honestly, man, you know, chasing this lifestyle and just, you know, being out here and, and trying to make some shape, like, I seen it all. Like, you know, when we first got together, everything was, you know, pretty cool, pretty solid. And as time went on, man, it's just like, I've been noticing her, like, on the phone, late, texting people and stuff like that. You know, we've been together about five years, so, you know, I know her in and out, you know. And, uh, you know, I'm in the music business, and I'm, I keep trying to explain to her, man, like, this this business ain't what she think it is, you know. But I seem, it seemed like more and more she's just chasing the lights, and she's chasing the fame and the fortune. You know, it ain't, it ain't really panning out for it too much, you know what I'm saying? And I just want to, you know, I think she need to get her priorities in check. And, uh, you know, I just, you know, I got that feeling, man. So how far do you feel like she would go to chase this lifestyle? While further interviewing Rome, I learned that she is currently unemployed. However, the life that she lives on Instagram is the complete opposite. I mean, <sighs> you know, hey, they say everybody's single if the right person asks them. I mean, she can't really afford to, you know, pay for this lifestyle. You know, she's asking me for crazy things, you know, BBLs. She wants flights every BBL weekend. Is crazy. You know, fly her and her friends out, expensive dinners and stuff like that. And it's, you know, it's... Does, does she have a job? If Pretty was being a job, then she has one. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. So she's chasing a lifestyle that she can't afford, basically. That's yeah. What so about the job thing. So she had mentioned to me once about like, you know, dancing or like, you know, stripping or starting the OnlyFans. And you know, I told her straight up, I wasn't with it. I don't, I don't want to see her out there like that. You know? So to top it all off, Naya's desperation to keep up with this lifestyle has led her to asking Rome how he feels about her starting an OnlyFans. Rome understands why she asked. She just wants to make extra money. But he still told her no because he feels like as his girl, he just doesn't want to see her in that light. Yeah, so look, I this is where the loyalty it. test is going to be taking place at. It's going to be at this house right here. I don't have a plan yet for how I'm going to set everything up. Right. However, in the next few days, I'm gonna get back to you and we're gonna meet up here again, okay? Bet it. Nice to meet you. All right, man, nice to meet you too. Appreciate Rome. you, man. Hope everything doesn't work out, but it works out at the same time. Before I went through with executing this loyalty test, I had the perfect person in mind to play role as decoy. So without further ado, you guys, allow uh, me to Gucci. introduce you to my boy Gucci, a reality uh. TV show star from seasons one and two on Deja Vu uh. on Now That's TV. And he was also seen on Catfish, which is weird because there's guys literally out here acting like him to get girls, which made him the perfect person to play decoy on his loyalty test because 24 hours before this, we set up a fake audition for his own reality reality show, which she thinks that she's about to be a part of. However, this was all a set up to see if she would trade her partner for a chance to be famous. Yo, Gucci. Hey, say what's up to the cam, bro. Yo, what the fuck going on? Bro, I need your help setting up a girl to see if we can make her cheat, bro. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm the guy, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you try, you know what I'm saying? If you try to make me Say less. Hey, hey, you don't got to do too much more talking, my boy. Stay tuned. I'm going to hit you up in a few days. All right, bro? All right, bet, bro. Be safe. All right, y'all, bro, man. We literally just made it, and we got Gucci. Oh, shit. As you guys can see, I had the what? perfect decoy secured. However, right after that phone call, I got into a car accident. Yo, bro, I just hit your car? Yep. And I had to pay for the damages. My car. Yo. You think 200 would be enough to cover it? 
Instead of going through insurance, which would have raised my rates, I showed him a way to get the money to pay for the damages. I can show you a survey real quick so you can make the money to pay for it. Right, bro. Stop doing this bullshit, bro. Stop doing this bullshit, bro. Damn, bro. You can get it sent to you through Cash App, Zelle, direct deposit. How do you want it? I mean, I'd prefer Cash App, probably. Perfect. To set up this audition, we rented out a beautiful house in the heart of Atlanta. And to make it more realistic, we had Don as our security guard since Naya has never actually met him. Big yeah. auditions like this usually have a professional look, so we set up lighting equipment all around the house to give it that effect. So the only thing that we needed to do now was convince Rome's girlfriend to show up. Which will be a no-brainer for her because she wants to be famous. And this is the perfect opportunity. So in order to do it, it was simple. We sent a casting call to Rome, Rome sent it to Naya, and Naya agreed. That's simple. Usually before these tests, I like to set up five to 10 hours before so we have the right camera locations and everything is set up as planned. However, Gucci ends up pulling up three hours later because he had something to handle with a girl, I guess. At this point, we had about two hours before the test, so I went ahead and gave him the rundown on how everything was supposed to go. So this girl right here, she's actually an aspiring actress and she wants to become famous and be in a position like you. It's crazy this happened because I'm actually looking for more girls in my show. <laughs> oh shit. So let's just say hypothetically she passes the test. Will she be able to actually be on your show? She definitely won't be on the show. Oh shit. Are you, are, you, are you cool with that? Gucci said if this girl actually passes the test, she will literally have an opportunity to really be on his own reality show, which changes the whole dynamics to this test because if she literally passes, she will actually have a chance to really become famous. Mind you guys, we are all rooting for her at this point. This can literally be a life-changing opportunity Ooh, okay. for her. All she has to do is be loyal and everything that she's worked so hard for these past 10 years will be coming true. Now that everything was set up and ready to go, we let Rome know that it's okay to call Nia to let her know that he's on his way to pick her up for the audition. Hello. Hey, baby, what's happening? What you want? Nothing, just getting ready. All right, well, listen, I'm at the crib right now. I talked to the people. Uh, they said you need to be at the audition by like around nine. So get ready. I'm finna come pick you up. Okay, and how long is it gonna take? They ain't really say, but they just said be there by nine. They're gonna, you know, they're gonna shoot you, and you know, we're gonna get everything together. All right, I'm almost done. So this is probably outside. All right, that's about on my way. Okay. All right. So in about an hour, Rome will be back here to drop off Naya, and this test will begin. So without further ado, let's catch us a soulless fucking cheater. Upon Naya's arrival began phase one of this loyalty test. She was greeted by Quan, who introduced her to Gucci. Gucci greeted her and made her feel comfortable with this audition. They also made her sign NDAs. So Quan's job is to see how far she would go to get this role. And would she leave her boyfriend for it? In this last one right here? Wait, wait, hold on. Hold on. Before you sign that, mm -hmm. do you know who this is? I mean, yeah, Gucci. Where, where do you know him from, like? I mean, Twitter, OnlyFans, reality show, of course. I mean, what else? Okay, so my thing is this. Do you believe he can take it to the next level? Because I know he can. But do you believe that he can take it to the next level? Hell, he said it's why I'm here. So with that being said, sign that paper and let's get to work. But wait, are you willing to do whatever to make your dream come true? I want to be here with her. All right, let's get it done. Uh, she's the one. She's definitely the one for the reality TV show. My, I make stars overnight, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I don't see it happen. I don't see it happen. I'm pretty they got much a 60 you know, subtitles. for reality. I don't see girls yeah, from the show. Everything on those TV, you know. And look, you ain't, you ain't tell her. I don't see girls from the show get their own show and do their own thing yeah, and feature him on it. I seen some of them on the phone too. Is that something that you're interested in? Like having your own show, or you just want to be a star on somebody else's show? I mean, I definitely want my own show at some point, but it's a great way to start out with Gucci. Yeah, because like I say, my business partner here, you know, he has a blueprint for all of that, mm -hmm. and I just feel like. If this is what you want to do, you got to be all in. Well, like I said before, I would be all here. All out. Well, I'm definitely all in. That's why I'm here. She's definitely the one. No, I think so. Definitely one. So. So you think you you ready? Have you ever been um Have you ever been recorded before? I mean, what you mean? Like on the band recorded? Bro, this is the second time this girl is brought up in OnlyFans. Luckily, Quan did us all the favor and asked her about it. Shit, I mean, there you go. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Why you, why you OnlyFans record? Why you say that? I mean, you know, that's the craze right now. Everybody's on OnlyFans. 
Uh, that was it, but... I mean, have you ever thought about making all these things? Okay, I got a question. Is yeah. that camera on? Nah, not right now. But I'll only cut it on when you're ready. Oh, okay. Just to make you comfortable, so you let us know when you're ready, we'll cut it on. Okay. But yeah, um... You can say anything. You can tell us everything. We ain't gonna tell nobody. Yeah, between us. Well, I do have an awful thing. This bitch is a fucking liar. So this was a big shock to all of us because in the interview, Ro mentioned to us that she said that she wanted to start an OnlyFans. I knew it. I fucking knew this bitch was lying, man. However, Rome told her that he was not comfortable with it. Starting the OnlyFans, and you know, I told her straight up, I wasn't with it. I don't, I don't want to see how I did like that, you know? So, she's been secretly hiding in OnlyFans from him this whole time. And now I see why she asked if that camera was on. It hasn't been that long. Like, seven months, for sure. Seven. Are you consistent on it? Because really. he needs somebody that's consistent. Why are you not consistent? I feel like you're a star. Like, that's what I'm saying. Why are you not consistent on it? Seven months? I gotta make it, and he don't want to be to have it. Yeah, worth it. So he's hindering you on your goal, right? Yeah, you can say that. Yeah. I can say that, or is it true? Is it true? And, like I say, That's all you need he's to doing know. what you want to do. He's doing what you want to do. So you should leave that situation alone. And chase the bag. So we still decide to continue Damn. the loyalty test because once again, she is auditioning for a reality show. So you gotta give her the benefit of the doubt because you never know, she might be doing all of this just for the audition to secure her spot. I already had in mind that she was gonna act like this. So to see if she would really cheat, we were gonna have Gucci actually ask her to go on a date. I just wanna know how ready you are to be, you know what I'm saying, on reality TV. This is 24 seven entertainment. You're gonna be on camera pretty much all, all through the day and night. Are you ready for that? I'm, I'm definitely ready. Have you, have you seen me? See what I look like? Can you give me 360? Can I see? Can I see you? That was too quick. Hey. 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 I, I definitely cool. think she's the one. That's enough. Damn. I said enough right there. It's definitely yeah. enough. That's enough. <laughs> In order to get Gucci to ask Naya on a date, we had to get him and her alone. So we had Quan make an excuse to leave. Oh, you know I'm saying even though you have a yo, I'll be right back. I'm receiving an important call. Y'all can see the. Okay, so. all right, all right. Let's see, bro. Right. We're we gonna chop it up. Let's see do this thing. All right, but let's start it. Let's get started. Right. Hope you're not shy with being on camera. No, I'm listening. I'm, I'm not shy. It's all good. So what they're about to record right now? We got the safe, you know. Okay, looking good. We looking good. good. Still if you guys know Gucci, Gucci is an expert at seducing women. So him asking her on a date was simple. But the builder before he popped off the question came with a lot of small talk. So I'm gonna skip that for you guys. But right before he popped the big question, Damn. he suddenly had to walk out because he had something important to handle in the middle of the test. Give me like, give me like five minutes real quick. All right, real quick, man. Real quick. If anything, just, uh, just, just, you know what I'm saying? Just let me know. But what happens when Gucci walks away, you will never believe. But what's she doing right here? Oh, she's smart. Oh, she's smart. Oh, she's smart. Bro, while waiting for Gucci to come back, tell me why this girl gets up, starts snooping around the house, going through drawers, and she ends up stealing my wallet. Of course, she probably thought it was Gucci's, but still, like, you're a thief and a cheater? And you lied about having OnlyFans? Bro, at this point, bro, I'm shocked, bro. Like, what was Damn. your purpose? I mean, you're a 4K and I'm gonna get my wallet back after the test is over, but like... Damn. <sighs> Just let the test go on, man. At this point, you guys, Naya is the first ever soulless thief on my channel. Where's she going? However, this test is far from over. 
because we still have to see if Naya will agree to go on a date with Gucci. This is crazy. She be stealing? Bro, I can't believe she just walked in there and took my but car. But finally, <laughs> after some time, Gucci finished up what he had to do, and he finally went back in to finish his test. So without further ado, let's catch us a soulless fucking cheater. Yeah, I just had to uh, take a leak real quick, you know what I'm saying? A little... Great lick. I swear on everything I love, I catch his cheating, I'm crashing the fuck out. Shit. You ain't gotta tell me twice. Must have forgot, you know what I'm saying? So, are you willing to, um, cause in my show, you know what I'm saying, it's a love show, I wanna know, like, you 100% willing to give you 100% to me, you know what I'm saying, into this show. So you can be a star, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm definitely trying to go over and beyond, cause, I've been trying to be famous for a long, 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 long time. I feel like a lot of stuff been in my way. I've been bullshitting, I've been playing. Like I said, I got a Ooh. kind of in the way too. Damn. Ooh. How are you, how are you settling for that when you could be, you know what I'm saying, up there, you know what I'm saying, to women to you, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I thought I was good, but. Yo, just, you yo. You know bag, and also, you know what I'm saying? I come with a lot too, you know what I'm saying? Just a bag, I got a lot. So you, know what I'm saying? So, how big the bag can I get you? Shit, it depends on how much you can take. Hmm. I like, I like the sound of <laughs> But, um, any more questions? Yeah, what type of woman, um, are you? Mm, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm actually really confident. Yeah. You know, I stand out. Um, the rest of the <laughs> be around me, so. Are you competitive? Are you the jealous type, you know? Definitely competitive. I don't know about jealous. Because I look like this and they look like that. So what they got to do with me? So let's say in the dating show, let's say like, you know, I ended up picking two girls. Are you willing to be in a polygamy relationship? Yeah, I, I, I can do that. I can definitely do that. Wow. You like girls too? A little bit. I like that, I like that. I don't, I don't play it in the field a little bit. Just, I like that. I like that. I like that. No, I definitely don't mind. I definitely don't mind. I mean, especially if that's what you want, I'm here for you, right? 100%, 100%. Yeah. I told you, I'm, like, I'm here. I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying to do this for real. And it's looking like you definitely, you know what I'm saying? That, that, that's the last pick on my show. What the fuck? Hold on. You know what I'm saying? Like, little, be little service interruption, I'm sorry, y'all. Awesome. Because of how someone wants to be. Like, tonight. Okay. Yeah. 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 I ain't gonna lie, I'm a little hungry. Like, he could order some food. I mean, yeah. Give me whatever the fuck I ask for, so. Why yo, not? Call him right now. <laughs> he, he like, he like, yo, call that green ass nigga right now. Let's see. Damn. Damn. Tell him to order Tell him to order some pizza. All right. <laughs> Let me see this. This is my girl. Man, mm. man f this man. So we can answer. Cool, man. Like for real. Like, just what the fuck are you doing? See, fuck that. You know what I'm saying? He's not worried about you. Like, I, you know what I'm saying? Like, hey. you, you definitely should. Uh, you know what I'm saying? See what's right in front of you. Just... I, I see. A, I see a bag in front of me. So, uh, like my my eyes looking real good. You know what I'm saying? So, so I really got the last slide. I feel like, I feel like you have everything to offer. Am I picking the wrong, the wrong girl? Is that what you have right now? No, I didn't say that. I just asked the question. That's it. That's all. I just want to make sure. I like that. I like that. Okay, so when do I get information for like filming and all that stuff? So my, uh, my assistant would definitely be, you know what I'm saying, in touch with you more about that. You know, honestly, like, are you, are you ready for real? Because this is about to go viral overnight, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you're gonna be doing a whole lot of crazy shit on my show. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be like, you're gonna be able to keep up. Um, I can keep up with a lot of things. Yeah, you sure. definitely want to. That's not a problem. You sure, you, you sure like, you know what I'm saying? Like the lifestyle not gonna be too crazy, but. Like, 
I am the lifestyle. I'm lit, for real. Ooh, for real life. Oh, you know. That's, that's your birthday? Hell yeah, I'm gonna fuck. Hello. Yeah, what's going on? Um, hey baby, um, I was just calling because I'm kind of hungry and they don't have nothing here. So can you send me some money for some pizza? I can't believe Gucci just did that. Me personally, that is disrespectful. Send you some money for some pizza, huh? That's what you want. Yeah, I'm hungry. Hey, okay, listen. Hey, uh, you this, right? Who the f think you playing with? Huh? No, 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 no. On some real shit, who the f you lost your rabbit ass mind? Who the f what? Oh my gosh, bro. This nigga fumbled, bro. Come on, bro. Oh, no. I can't say he fumbled because he's pissed off, so I can't really. Oh, me? I would have stuck along. I would have kept going with it, bro, to hurt my own feelings even more. Why are you acting like that? What, what you tripping for? Is this pizza? Hey, 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 hey. You can't talk about this at the same time. What do you think you fucking fucking? You got your fucking fucking Whoa, hold the fuck up. Who the fuck are you talking to like that? I'm you tripping the f I'm Bro, I'm bye, bye. Don't get out the room. I do not know. Man, you can't trust these bitches, man. Shit crazy, man. Look, bro. It's alright, bro. <laughs> yeah. Relax. Bro, you you'll find a better one, bro. Thank you ain't so. be dealing with this bullshit, bro. I ain't gonna deal with this shit, man. This shit is bullshit, man. Look at this lame ass bitch. Man, I'm ready to confront him, man. Don't waste energy on it, bro. Let's just wrap this up. Let's go confront him. Sure, I'm ready with it. Let's do it. Before we expose this soulless cheater, I want to get, get this shit off my fucking screen, bro. I'm not going to ask again, bro. You trifling ass oh, bitch. You a trifling ass bitch. You know that? You a mother trifling ass bitch. That's what you what doing? You doing? I'm out here spending money on shit. I'm spending money on chips. I'm taking you all around the fucking world. I'm paying money and shit like that. You not balling, baby. I got it like that. I really got it like that. I'm having real emotion like that, baby. You a lame ass bitch. At this point, you guys, things started to get out of control. Not only was he mad at his girlfriend for cheating, he was mad at Gucci for taking it as far as he did. Bro. Rome felt like Gucci disrespected him by making his girlfriend call him to order food while he knew he was watching the test. I can kind of see where he's coming from. But at the end, niggas do that all the time, bro. That is nothing new, bro. Niggas need to get niggas need to get on game, bro. Stop, bro. All right, let me shut up. Let me shut up. The day, guys. Yo, niggas, there were still yeah. bigger things to handle <laughs> no. because, mind you, this girl still has my wallet in her purse. But at the end of the day, bro. Gucci, that's not his responsibility. So tell me if I'm wrong, guys. Was I wrong for asking her to please hand me my shit back? But you was a lame like fuck. And I told you, bro, don't do too motherfucking much, bro. And you're doing too much. Hey, 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 Oh, you want to oh, do chill out, bro. Chill out, bro. Nah, it ain't about all that, bro. Hey, I, I, hey, I, I, I told you, I told you, bro. Don't do too fucking much, but you doing too fucking much, bro. Crashing out, bro. Because if I if I go to the truck, I'm gonna clear all this shit out, bro. I'm gonna clear her out first. And that's how you feel, bro. That's how you feel, bro. I came to you like a man. I told you, do me a little motherfucking thing, and you doing shit like that. And that bitch, man. Man, you can have each other, man. But you lame as hell, bro. Baby, baby, wait, 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 baby, you know I'm selling records out here, right? You know I'm selling records out here, right? Hold on, let me explain. Let me say something. Let me what say something. you talking about? Can I explain? Do you understand what's going on right now? No, I don't. Basically, this whole thing was a setup to see if you would cheat on him for an opportunity to be famous. Okay. And as you can see, you basically failed. And I just want to let you know that you will never have a chance to collab with Gucci a day in your life. Mm -hmm. And we also see you steal my shit on camera. Can I please get my shit? She's stealing. Watch your pockets. Watch your wallet. She's stealing. She broke. Hey, everybody be quiet. Seriously, be quiet. Be quiet. Real quick. Real quick. Oh, Genuinely, man. me, I saw all the cameras set up all around the house. I saw you take all the you are not going to be able to leave this house. You're not going to be able to leave this house. These bitches are crazy, bro. I'm spending money on this bitch. She can't afford to pay attention. You understand that? No, hey, y'all hey, be quiet, y'all be quiet. At this point, I didn't even care about my wallet. If I wanted to, I could cancel my cards, I could do a lot to hide my information, and I could get a new wallet. However, I was more concerned about my safety and my team's safety, especially with us not even having a real security guard on standby. Okay. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna get leave, right? What are you doing? 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 What are you doing
Just give me my shit. 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 Man, she ain't gonna do shit. She ain't really about that. She ain't really about that. Credit card. Credit card. That's my credit card. That's my credit card. That's my credit card. That's lame as hell, bro. And put your weapon. Man, I thought you, I thought you would cut like that. Make me put it down. Make me put it down. Make me put it down. Ah, ah, yeah. Sit down, sit down. Yeah, yeah. Damn, you really gonna stab like that, bro? Bro, why you did? You gonna stab the nigga? You, you don't think you gonna fucking stab? You gonna stab? Damn. What would you like? You can't fuck me. You won't, man. You won't. What kind of shit is that? Too much, bro. Yes, you guys, I did end up getting stabbed in this clip. Try to grab her arm to get the knife out of her hand. But she literally swings her arm higher than I could grab it and she punctures me in the back. Immediately after Damn. I was punctured in the back, everything started spiraling out of control. Quan grabs me, he takes me to the car to make sure I'm safe and good. I'm literally in the back seat bleeding at this point, bro. From this point on, I didn't know what was going on. I was still in shock because I just got stabbed and everything was going out of control. <laughs> You guys, this situation took place two months ago, and I've healed very well since the situation. Naya, to you, good, I just want to say that I'm not mad at you for what you did. I genuinely wanted to see you make it one day. You literally had the opportunity to achieve all of your dreams, but all you had to do was be loyal. All I want to say is, man, please like the video, because we really need security. Thank you guys so, so much for watching this video, man. And until next time on Catching Soulless Cheaters. I only say these niggas change.